Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to restrict access to different drives on your Windows 10 computer. So basically, if you have multiple users on your account and you want to restrict who can actually open up or access different drives, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So, it should be pretty straightforward. We're going to go ahead and jump into it. And we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. Type in regedit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result should come back a registry editor. You want to go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. Now before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. And in order to create the backup, it's very simple. You just would select file and then export. File name, I'd recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Export range, keep that at all, and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, you just would select File and then Import and navigate to Set File Location. So again, pretty straightforward process. And now we're ready to begin. So we're going to start by double clicking on the HK Current User folder. Do the same thing now for the Software folder. Same thing for Microsoft. Should be a Windows folder under here, so just scroll down a little bit, double click on that. And now it should be current version. Go ahead and double click on that. Locate policies and double click on it. Now, if you don't see an explorer folder under here, you might have to right click on this policies folder, select new and then key, and then name it explorer as you see on my screen here. But anyway, since we do have the explorer folder, we're just over here right now and we just left clicked on it one time. And on the right panel, you wanna go, you wanna right click in a blank area on the right panel select new and then select the word 32-bit value now you want to name this value no view on drive first letter of each word should be capitalized no spaces in here so again no view on drive hit enter now that you've done that double click on it select decimal and now this is very important so for the value data field this is what number corresponds to what letter of the alphabet basically so a would be value data one there will be different numbers depending on what drive letter you're using so I will actually include this in the description of the video here guys but just some of the more common ones the letter a drive would be the number one B would be two C would be four D would be eight E would be 16 F would be 32 G would be 64 basically it's just power of two which if you're familiar with computer coding actually has some significance but just for the purpose of this video I am just told you guys the first few letters more than likely 99% of you guys are going to have one of those but there's some really long numbers so it's maybe a little harder to do in your head when you get up to perhaps you know P or Q or R or something like that but anyway we're going to just type in one just say it's the letter a the a drive again like i said the number is going to be different depending on what drive letter and i will have that in the description of the video just select ok and now you will need to restart your computer in order for that to take effect so you can close out of the registry editor restart your computer and then it should restrict access to that drive for your users on that account so pretty straightforward process guys i do hope that i was able to help you out and i do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial Goodbye.